Welcome to BeagleSat, a Linux-based open-source nano-satellite platform powered by the affordable yet versatile BeagleBone Embedded Development Board, aimed at students, scientists, and everyone interested in putting their ideas into space. Sounds good, but what is a nano-satellite? When we're talking about satellites, we usually think of these huge, technology-packed boxes weighing a couple of tons. Orders of magnitude smaller and shedding a few pounds, nanosatellites are miniaturized versions of their bigger counterparts. Sometimes referred to as CubeSats, they enable missions that a larger satellite cannot accomplish and do so for a fraction of the price. Their usage? It ranges from constellations of orbital imaging satellites, to terrestrial gamma ray burst research, to experimental solar sail concepts. That last one? It's called Light Sail, and it's happening right now. But where was I? Alright, oh, the BeagleSat project. Its purpose? To enable makers and researchers around the world to build awesome CubeSat projects. To do so with off-the-shelf components, with a streamlined development framework within a community of shared ideas and solutions. There are three phases to BeagleSat. This project focuses on phase one. Its mission, to implement state-of-the-art sensor fusion algorithms to assist in orbit determination and precision pointing. This includes compensating techniques developed and tested by a number of research groups that enable accurate measurements on smaller spacecraft without sensor booms. The core of the issue is insulating electromagnetic interference. While on bigger satellites, sensors are isolated from onboard sources of electromagnetic interference, usually by placing them on extended booms. This approach is not feasible on compact designs. We circumvent these issues by using filtering and correction algorithms. The project will be completed using a BeagleBoom Black, an embedded Linux development platform. The MPU9250 inertial measurement unit and the PNI RM3100 will be used for testing sensory input with expansion to other off-the-shell sensors planned for the future. A diagram of the correction algorithm can be seen on the slide. The correction algorithm is based on estimating compensation factors for each individual sensor axis. The factors are obtained by comparing a body of collected sensory data to a model based on the International Geomagnetic Reference Field. The model is further enhanced by onboard telemetry data to correct for variations in locally produced interference. Once computed, the correction factors are used on incoming sensory data to provide measurements that do not include contributions from the spacecraft itself. The project will take place from May 25th to August 24th, 2015. A summary of the weekly schedule can be found right here. My name is Niko Vishnich, and this is BeagleSat, a Google Summer of Code 2015 project developed under the BeagleBoard community, mentored by Steve Arnold, Alexander Hayam, and Kumar Abhishek. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned by following the link below.